Hello, friend. Oh my gosh. So I got cheek filler. <laughs> I know, super, super, super random, but it was for good reason. So I do wanna say that this video is a follow-up to my under eye filler video that I shot a few months ago. In that video, I expressed why getting under eye filler was so important to me. And let me just reiterate really quickly, I had really, really deep under eye creases and I used to feel so insecure about my under eye area. Even when I had makeup on, I could still see see the deep, 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 deep creases under my eyes. And then when I didn't have makeup on, I looked tired. Even though I was well rested, my skincare routine was on point, I felt like there was nothing else I could do to get rid of them. So when I had the opportunity to get under eye filler, I definitely jumped at it. And I want to say to you that Getting under eye filler for me has been a game changer in just my overall look, my sense of confidence, and just my beauty routine overall. Now, I know a lot of us are like, cheek filler. <laughs> You know, there's definitely a negative connotation when it comes to cheek filler and the way that it can end up looking and how overdone it can be on some people. But I wanna rest assured, like, your girl got, got cheek filler. I got it twice <laughs> and I'm here. I still look like me, I still feel like me. And um, I do want you to know that in the case of having deep under eye creases and whatnot, cheek filler can actually be a huge help in that because cheek filler is essentially the foundation. So you can get your cheek filled right here. This is where I got mine done. And this is going to lift that area and hold it up a little bit higher, whereas it can just kind of collapse and fall under and this is no longer your eye. So you never wanna overfill your under eyes so cheek filler is a great alternative or addition that can really make that under eye area look good, honey, because let me just let me just get a close up. I know I have makeup on now, but I'm going to show y'all myself without makeup. And I am just so pleased, so pleased with these results. Now, I will say the number one question that I always get, does it hurt? <laughs> <laughs> so when it came to the under eye filler, I did not feel it at all. I was completely numbed um, and you know, you really don't feel it because they go in with a canela instead of a traditional needle. But I will say for the cheek filler, you do feel it. There is a slight amount of discomfort. Um, it wasn't painful enough where I was like, oh, ah, like it was more so I guess it just feels weird to know that you have something going on like on your face and under your eyes. But overall for me, as I was getting it done, it really wasn't that bad. There was some pain to it, but I've gotten my eyebrows microbladed. I've gotten Brazilian waxes, underarm waxes. I'm okay. <laughs> so it really wasn't bad. And afterwards, the first time that I got cheek filler, um, I actually did have a little bit of swelling and a little bit of tenderness to touch in the areas. Um, this second time that I got it done and I finished up the entire tweakment, now I feel content with my under eye and cheek filler procedures. I actually got no swelling at all. I maybe, maybe Maybe there was like a tiny bit that day, but like I got no noticeable swelling, no bruising. Um, it was just a little bit, again, tender to touch in the area that they pierced. So aside from that, it really wasn't that bad. And then the recovery time is super quick. You can literally, you know, go outside that same day. The next day you'll be totally fine. So for me, the procedure of under eye and cheek filler is a no-brainer like if I could get <laughs> my under eyes fixed and <laughs> not have to worry about them anymore and not have this huge recovery time I feel so happy about it and I love the fact that obviously they're using something that is natural to you so it's hyaluronic acid serum which is you know very very important so before we get into the actual procedure of the cheek filler, I do want to note that my friends at Sisu Clinic were so happy with my last video that they were like, let's offer your followers $100 off. So if you go into any Sisu Clinic location and mention that Aisha Bo sent you or use the link that I'm going to leave in my description box below, you'll get $100 off. And I'm excited to say that Sisu Clinic has 
two locations in New York. They have a location in Houston, Miami, and Fort Lauderdale. So if you are in or near any of those areas, I would highly suggest checking out Sisu Clinic because they are the real deal. And take it from your girl, the proof is in the, the face, not the pudding, but... <laughs> I'm just so happy with my results. I literally talk about them all the time with anyone who wants to listen. And yeah, I just couldn't be happier. So with that said, I'm going to get into the procedure. And I do want to note that there is some use of needles in this video. So if you are a little squeamish or feel a little grossed out, um, I would say maybe skip over that part um, and just get to the ending where I showcase my face without any makeup so you can see all of the results to my under eye and cheek filler procedures. So let's get into it. I'm like, there we go. Okay. <laughs> it's fine. I just had to pull my hair up because um, my hair was down. Here we are. <laughs> All right. Let's get some before and after pictures. Yes. So. Right. Yeah. Okay. okay, so tell me what you see and what we, we discussed before. All right. So, you came for under eye filler. The under eye filler still looks great. Mm -hmm. We did a little, little bit of cheek filler touch up afterwards, just in the medial cheek area for a little bit of support. Looks great. I would do a little bit of balancing also, just facial balancing in general, just yeah. because the left side a little more so because we did a little bit of correction on the left side here. Mm -hmm. So like right here on the right side, it does look really, really smooth and it does look really, really good, but you could use a touch. Mm -hmm. I would actually recommend using Sculptra. Okay. So what Sculptra is, it's polyelectric acid. Fancy, fancy word for it is something that's made in our body. It's a biostimulatory product. Pretty much when we are 23 to 25 years old, we stop producing any collagen. Mm -hmm. Done. Mm -hmm. Every year after that, we lose about 2% of that, 1 to 2% of that. So what this does is it re-stimulates collagen, mm -hmm. which is great. Because yeah. you're literally gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> Usually with filler, is an instant gratification. Instantly restores volume. We see it right away. With sculpture, it's a little bit different because it is biostimulatory. It's very gradual. But it'll okay. gradually give you back the collagen. It'll give you a little bit of a lift. I personally like to put it literally, it's like all over the face. So we kind of kickstart everything. It gives you even like a nice little lift. It's wonderful. You're going to love it. Okay. But in areas where you have such a subtle, minimal deficit, mm -hmm. where you still want that lift and you still want that result, I usually do recommend Sculptra, especially like just your face in general. Like I don't want to augment it too much. Mm -hmm. I would prefer something more natural. Okay. And I love like like literally love your face. <laughs> <laughs> I love your face too. <laughs> <laughs> so so although we could, so we could honestly do both. We could literally do. Um, a little bit of cheek filler today if you want that instant balancing mm -hmm. but Sculptra is something that I do want to incorporate into the regimen that you're kind of building just because you have that instant gratification with the filler and then you kind of want your collagen to re-stimulate give you that tightness back helps with skin tone texture quality mm -hmm. lift all the above okay. it's just like yeah yeah, yeah. and then with that is you pretty much get one vial Mm -hmm. um, usually the FDA um, guidelines mm -hmm. are one vial per decade that you're alive, you know, like if you're 30, it'll be three vials. Mm -hmm. So pretty much, I don't like to obviously put three vials in at once because it is a lot of product. Right. So with you especially, I'd probably do like one vial, have you come back, mm -hmm. and then you pretty much be like touching up on top of the collagen because although we are re-stimulating your collagen, it's like we're kind of, we're almost like playing catch up almost because we're not uh, stopping time. Yeah, so yeah. like, as that year of us losing that collagen, we're trying to regain the collagen because nothing's really like standing still. So it's kind of just like making sure that you're maintaining that level. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. And so how often would I then do the sculpture? Every year. Okay, so mm -hmm. it's once a year. Yeah. Okay, that's yeah. great. I would say every year is literally gonna get to the point that it's, it's so gradual that a lot of times because you don't see that instant gratification, you see it in about six weeks, because mm. um, that's literally when that uh, polyelectric acid pretty much like, kicks in. Yeah. So that's when you would kind of see it. I always have everyone come in for a follow-up. There are obviously 
people that need more than one vial. Mm -hmm. So in the case where I would be like, you need another vial, mm -hmm. you'd come back in six weeks and then you do another vial on that. Got you. Okay, that sounds cool. Okay, yes. So I'm, I'm open to doing sculpture. Yeah. And I also want instant gratification. <laughs> I, I'm like, I know you want instant I'm like, I'm like, and I also yeah. want instant yes. gratification. Yes. But yes. So today you can do that cheek filler. It's going to be such a small amount. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a little bit of balancing. Mm -hmm. Like literally like a micro drop. Yeah. Um, and of course we have you follow up in two weeks in case we need to touch up a little bit more. Mm -hmm. um, but especially with their face, I kind of like start a little, little yeah. bit. Yeah. That sounds great. Thanks, Stephanie. So today we're gonna do some cheek filler just for a little bit of balancing, and then I'm gonna come back in six weeks and we're gonna do some sculpture, which I'm really excited about. I'm gonna look so glowy this summer. <laughs> You're gonna look great. Yes. You're gonna love it. I can't You're wait. Gonna love it. Perfect. I'm getting numbed, but still just in case. Well, under eye filler, I didn't feel it at all. Yeah. But. So with under eye filler, we use an injectable numbing cream. Mm -hmm. Well, injectable numbing cream. Not numbing cream. <laughs> <laughs> There's also lidocaine in the actual filler. Mm -hmm. So as you inject, you feel a little bit less. Heaviness the next 
say like swelling, uh -huh. that'll happen. If you have mm -hmm. any, any extreme pain, it's not going to be that bad, obviously. Right. You can take kind of normal drink, just no aspirin. Mm -hmm. Ice, if you like. Yeah. Alright, cool. And then we'll see you back in Chile. Yes. Amazing. Right. Thank you. Right. Thank you so much. I'm so happy. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Wow. This looks so good. <laughs> looks so good. It looks really good. Uh, okay. It looks really good. Okay, so here I am one week after my second cheek filler appointment and I do want to say that I am actually like I'm sad that I didn't record my first cheek filler appointment because after that appointment I did get like a little bit of swelling for a few days but this second one I got no swelling at all and it doesn't look like I'm gonna get any scarring either and I'm just I'm just so so happy with the results that I've gotten with my under eye and cheek filler. And it just goes to show you that it may not exactly be under eye that you need, or you might need both. But I will say that the cheek filler definitely, definitely made like a huge change and a huge improvement. And I'm just, ugh, I'm just so happy with the results. Let's get a close up. Look at that, so smooth. I'm just like really, really happy with how it looks and how my under eye looks. And of course you're gonna have some type of line because that's just the way your face is, but I like the fact that it's not a super deep, deep, deep dark crease anymore. And although filler doesn't get rid of dark under eye circles or darkness under eyes, the illusion of the darkness, because I knew, I knew that my under eye wasn't dark because I was doing such great with my, I was doing very well with my skincare, I was getting enough sleep, drinking a lot of water, but because of the fact that my under eye creases were so deep, it gave more of an illusion of darkness under my eyes. So now, like, oh, I'm just so, so, so happy. I could not be happier with my results and I had to make sure that I ended this video with myself without any makeup on just so you can truly see the full effect, see my face, see that I don't have any scarring. Um, I did get like a small scar from my very first cheek filler appointment which I mentioned but that already has faded away. There's like a tiny, tiny, tiny like remnant of the scar here but again like I said it definitely is fading away and I can just pop some makeup on over it and let me tell you <laughs> I mean if you saw the beginning of the video my makeup looks flawless now and I'm just uh, I couldn't be happier with the results and if you are like me and you feel really insecure about your under eye area, your under eye bags, creases, whatever it is under your eyes, I highly, highly recommend visiting Sisu Clinic and talking to one of their specialists and seeing what you might need to get done. And I will say that I feel a boost of confidence and I don't feel like I need to go there now every single week and get 20 different treatments to alter my face completely. I just feel like sometimes we need those small tweakments to really make a big impact and <laughs> I'm just, I'm, I'm pleased. I'm very, very pleased. Like whenever I get a chance, I'm like looking in the mirror and I'm like, wow. I look like I'm well rested. <laughs> I just am so happy about it. So if you're interested in getting a tweakment done, seeing what you might need, talking to someone at Sisu Clinic, I absolutely urge you to going and checking one of their clinics out. So Sisu is located in New York, Houston, Miami, and Fort Lauderdale right now, and they're continuing to expand. So whenever you go in and you set your appointment, make sure that you mention that Aisha Bo sent you. I'm gonna put a special link down below that you can use to fill out for your appointment, and they're gonna give you $100 off of your treatment. Now, every penny counts, so if I was you, I would absolutely take that offer. Thank you so much again for watching. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, or feedback, please be sure to leave them in the comment section below. Y'all know I love to hear from you. If you like this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. And if you haven't already, make sure that you subscribe and hit that bell icon so you know my next video goes live. Thank you so much again for watching. Until next time.